the components required for this experiment are ESP32 board, BME680 sensor, connecting cable and connecting wires. Now log in to the Bling.Cloud website. Then go to Developer Zone. Here click New Template and give the template name Pollution Monitoring System. And select the hardware as ESP32 and connection type as Wi Fi and click on the Done button. Now go to Setup Data Streams. Here click New Data Stream and select the Virtual Pin and give the first variable name as Temperature. Here select the pin as V0, data type as double and select the unit as Celsius and give the maximum value as 100. We can also change the color from here and click create button. Now again go to new data stream, select virtual pin and here enter the variable name as humidity. Here, here the pin is V1, data type is double and the unit is percentage. Here also the maximum value is 100. Click on the create button. Now we need to create the third variable. Again go to new data stream, select virtual pin and the third variable is pressure. Here the pin is V2, data type is double. Here select the unit as hectopascal and the maximum value is 3000. And click on the create button. Now the final variable again go to new data stream select virtual pin and this is for air quality. Here the pin is V3 data type is double and select the maximum value as 500. Click on the create button. Now go to web dashboard and here we need to drag 4 gauge widgets. Now go to the settings of the first gauge and here choose the data stream as temperature. Click save. Now go to the second gauge settings. Here choose humidity. Click save. Now go to the third gauge settings and here we need to choose pressure. Change the color and click save. Now the final one go to settings again. Here choose air quality and click save. Now save the template. Now go to the devices menu from the left side. Here click new device and then select from template. Here we can see the template which we created pollution monitoring system. Select that and click on the create button. Now we got the template ID, template name and authentication token. Click here and copy. Now go to your program and paste here. Here we need to install these libraries Adafruit sensor, Adafruit underscore BMA680 and the Blink library. Then enter the Wi-Fi username and password. Now we need to upload the program. For that go to this drop down. Here the port is already selected. Click on that. Here we need to select the board. We are using ESP32 board. So search for ESP32 dev module. So here it is ESP32 dev module. Select that. Click OK. Now click this upload button and upload the program to the ESP32 board. Now the program is successfully uploaded to the ESP32 board. Now we can set up the Blink mobile dashboard. For that, download the Blink IoT application from the Play Store. Once you open the application, you can see the template which we created in the Blink web dashboard. Now click on the template Pollution Monitoring System. Now go to Settings. Now you can see the plus icon from the bottom of the page. Click that. Here we need to add 4 gauge like we did in the Blink web dashboard. Now click on the first gauge. Here choose the data stream as temperature. Now go to design and give the same title temperature. Now go back. Now click the second gauge. Here choose the data stream as humidity. Go to design and give the title as humidity. 
go back now click the third gauge so here we need to choose uh, pressure go to design give the title as pressure this title is optional you can ignore that now go back now click on the final gauge here choose data stream as air quality go to design and here also we can give the title as air quality now go back again click the back button now the setup is completed now we can check the output 